Okay, so we're, we're recording. Hey, everyone. How's it going? So, um, obviously, if you can tell by my tone, I kind of have something I want to talk to you about. Um, within the past couple of days, my life has been good. I've met great people. I've talked with great people. And all around my day, my week, this week has been great. Um, Wednesday I was able to hang out with my friends again for the first time in a while since we got out of high school. Actually, no. Since, uh, one of my friends' grad parties. Um, a YouTuber that I admire. Um, I'm going to tag him in it because he deserves it. Um, that voice guy made my freaking day when he when he liked one of my videos that I had tag of him and he called it very inspiring and the moment I saw that tweet it was I shut down because you guys, like I put in that video um I uploaded yesterday or whatever it completely changed the day and then after that when I was watching his live his live stream it was like this is amazing like, I talked to some of the people in the comments, and they were amazing, and they were awesome. And today I hear about, like, some of the stuff, like, like, LOL Renee, Gas Mexican, Diction, you just, when good YouTubers, amazing people, just can help some of these people through their life, it's amazing, and I love it. This is why YouTube was created. To help people through their life. It was not so people could get famous. It wasn't so you could see these people making money off of, of views. But the reason that has happened is because... You know, people want to do it. They love you guys. But getting paid for that is just a bonus to them. The best YouTubers are the ones that are most thankful for everything they get. Take, um, take me like He reached 2 million subscribers recently and thanked everyone for it. And I believe he is genuine in saying it because you hear about it. When I, when I hear about, uh, Tay Smarty, Smarticus, um, reaching one of his recent goals of, 10,000 it blows my mind and they hear about all these other giveaways and stuff that it's amazing to see some of the people that are just dedicated to other YouTubers it's awesome and I'm dedicated to them too because I subscribe to them because I like seeing what they have seeing how they act in certain situations it's just it's awesome to me and if it's something that they say that most people be like, well, you shouldn't say that, I think of it as it's a genuine reaction that you get from someone. Um, and I think every time they're being genuine, and I believe they do, every, every, everyone I watch, they're being genuine. Because I've seen different perspectives every single time, and it's amazing. I love it. I think that's what inspires me to um, kind of become a motivational speaker, to become a radio broadcaster. And I do YouTube as kind of like my starting point. Um, and also, if you guys check my Twitter, you saw my kind of rant I, I made about how I've been seeing stuff I'm not gonna say their names. Um, there, but there are some YouTubers I've I watch, ones I watch a lot, um, who very recently had uh, their the people they they have that are in the life that are very important to them. Some people have been just being vulgar and irritating and just all around nasty people, and I'm thinking, what? Like, what do you get out of that? 
how can you, someone who probably barely has any followers, and if you do, it's because you follow a whole hell of a lot more people, how do you have this? And the only reason why your channel's getting any contact is because you're being a massive dick. Some of the nicest people that are in these YouTubers' world. You don't want to say their names, but if you're going to be a dick to someone, you might as well just get rid of your Twitter because you don't need to be talking to anyone. It's going to be rude. And I, um, there's a trend on Twitter that it shouldn't be a trend just for a day. It should be an entire, like as long as Twitter is live, that should be a trend. There should be just thousands of it. There should be over billions of popular images out there. Because one positive message that you put out there can change someone's entire life. Take the idea of this, for example. Um, when I... I shouldn't say when I... When you tell a YouTuber how much you changed, how much they changed your life, no matter what you went through, that drives them so much more. Inspiration drives people. You sent them a positive message and you're seeing great content from them come out of that. Now, sure, I don't have the best stuff. I don't. I admit that. I'm not the best YouTuber. I have 23 subs. I almost have 6,000 total views. Do I care about subs? No. Do I care about views? No. What I care about is you guys. Because the fact that you get to be inspired by something I've said. Well, it makes me choke a little bit. <laughs> but it also makes me think that you guys really care with what you're seeing. That you're going to watch, you're going to like it, and all around you're going to have fun with it. And how long have I been going on for? Seven minutes. Wow. Um, that's me kind of trying to bust the mold. Um, because you guys know me, I don't have to be serious that much. Because when I do do serious stuff, it doesn't, no one wants to watch it. Which, with my friends, yeah, they want to see me, they want to see me being the me they, they uh, kind of know. The me that uh, is just fun loving. And I love being that guy. But I, I can also be probably a very serious guy that can inspire you. Um... So, if any of you guys um, want to like, type a comment below of something you want me to talk about, or you want me to just give advice to you, just put that in the comments. Send me something on Twitter. Do anything if it just helps you guys. Because... In all honesty, I'm nothing without you guys. I'm just a guy sitting in his room recording himself with his cell phone. That's all I am without you guys. Just some random guy on his phone recording himself and playing it on the end. You guys make YouTubers. You don't know that, but you're as much, in a way, a YouTuber yourself watching them. Because you're helping them. You're showing them that you like the video. You're showing them the content they should make. Do they care if people dislike it? You just, just kind of think, okay, maybe avoid certain things. And also, everyone... Um, Here's kind of kind of another thing I want to bring up. Um, if you say something vulgar, 
you have every right to call out for it. If you say something, or if you see something that is in the way that you know is dumb for that person to, to have just said, don't comment. Just don't. Just, you know, scroll along. They said it. You didn't like how it was worded. Move along. Because that's all you can do. Because people are going to hate. They're going to say stupid things. That's the world, though. And my leg just cracked up. So, yeah. Um, I know I don't like doing these that often. Because it feels kind of weird to do. Because you guys aren't used to it. You're used to seeing kind of like these fun videos or something. Where I'm laughing and we're having fun or I'm raging about something. My series videos don't get that many views. Mainly for the fact that it's not really seen for me to be serious. To be a guy that you can like talk to with everything. I mean, you you wouldn't approach me, right? You see me walking on the road, you're like, that guy's big. <laughs> Let's no. I'm a guy you can't approach. I don't want to be the guy that's like, he's big, uh, maybe we shouldn't talk to him. No, talk to me. I'm, I'm more than willing to talk to you. I don't know. I don't say this just because it gives me content from my videos. I say it because I genuinely want to help you guys. Because no one has, no one should feel sad. No one should feel Anything that makes them feel less of a person. One, because I know how that feels. And two, because no one should feel that. Not even if you're the biggest asshole ever. You shouldn't feel like you're anything less of a person. Someone tells you, hey, you're being kind of a jerk. Take it to heart. I did. Turn me around. Me and my friends closer. It's just how it works. So, kind of with this being all said, everyone. I want you guys to know. One thing. Well, actually, two things. These are nothing about the topic I talked about. Uh, on Monday, I'm getting a haircut, so hopefully this will be gone eventually. Because I don't think I like this anymore. This is just this is too bad. It's just too much. My hair should not go. Should not be able to touch my nose. Just no. If it goes past my eyebrows and does it kind of like a. Nope. No, I'm getting rid of it. I don't like it. Second off, um, I create a playlist. It's going to be my second album. So every song that I make. In the coming uh, months, what's going on that? Because I need a new album. So if you guys want, please check out the old one. On our way up, it's my first one. I hope you guys enjoy it. Hope you guys like it. If you can like it, favorite it, check it out, comment it. Tell me stuff you want me to sing about. The situations you think I should talk about. There's a comment section for a reason. And sorry there was a wire there. Thank you. And good night.